The music world is paying tribute to Meatloaf after the rocker died at the age of 74 on Thursday. Had so much fun with Meatloaf when we did Dead Ringer, Cher tweeted on Friday, referring to their 1981 collaboration, Dead Ringer for Love. I'm very sorry for his family, friends, comma, and fans, the Believe singer, 75, continued. Am I imagining it, or are amazing PPL and the arts dying every other day? Boy George, meanwhile, reminisced about a funny moment the two once shared. R.I.P. Meatloaf. Love and prayers to all his family and close friends, the Culture Club frontman, 60, tweeted. He once turned me upside down in a Chinese restaurant in St. John's Wood. Andrew Lloyd Webber honored Meatloaf's catalog of music, tweeting, The vaults of heaven will be ringing with rock. R.I.P. Meatloaf. The Phantom of the Opera composer, 73, added, Give my best to Jim, referring to Jim Steinman, Meatloaf's longtime collaborator and songwriter who died last year. Rick Astley added, Meatloaf. What a legend. Rest in peace, Rick X, with a photo of the Never Gonna Give You Up singer, 55, and his late pal. The I'd Do Anything for Love singer also received tributes from stars including Stephen Fry and Piers Morgan. I hope paradise is as you remember it from the dashboard light, Meatloaf. Had a fun time performing a sketch with him on Saturday Live Way back in the last century, the actor, 64, tweeted along with a clip of their skit. Fry added in another tweet, he had the quality of being simultaneously frightening and cuddly, which is rare and rather wonderful. And Morgan, 56, tweeted, R.I.P. Meatloaf, 74. One of rock music's all-time great characters whose seminal iconic album Bat Out of Hell is one of the biggest selling records in history. A wondrously talented, flamboyant, funny, outrageous and rebellious chameleon. Sad news. News of Meatloaf's death broke early morning on Friday, with his official Facebook page making the announcement. Our hearts are broken to announce that the incomparable Meatloaf passed away tonight with his wife Deborah by his side, the post read. Daughters Pearl and Amanda and close friends have been with him throughout the last 24 hours. Meatloaf, whose real name was Marvin Lee Day, had been seriously ill with COVID-19 just days before his death, TMZ reported. It is unclear whether he was vaccinated.